Hey guys, welcome back. I hope you've enjoyed this guess the price thing. And I, I wanna I wanna know first and foremost, if you enjoyed it, leave a comment below and tell me what you thought. If you thought I should change things up, if you thought I should add more money to the box or make it a little bit less and do one or two a month, let's let's have a, a conversation about it. I was trying to do this just to say thank you and really after the robo worm thing I was trying to do anything to get I just wanted that completely out of my life to be honest and uh, and I just appreciate everybody that's that's the God's honest truth I appreciate everybody who who comments and I feel like we're all a team here I think you're part of everything that I'm doing I know you might not see it but I really do feel like you are part of why I do this every day why I spend hours and hours and hours editing uh, I mean, I've got, I did two videos yesterday, to be honest. I'm I'm way ahead of the game. I've got uh, tons and tons of videos already done. I've got, if my computer will work, what the hell, there we go. Move this over here. I've got the closer look of the Little John, the Cumberland Apex Underspoon, the Ducket Fishing Sculpo. I'm not even sure if I say that right. The, uh, the Fresh Bait Scorpions, the... G Crack Gyrostar, the Guggenbait's Toad, the Hyperlastic Dart Prop, the Kalen's Rattling Google Eye Stalker, the Lunker Hunt Battle Beetle, the Molex Rattling Poplin Frog, the Sneaky Frog from Molex, the Savage Gear 3D Lizard, the Strike King Hybrid Hunter Bass Fishing Crankbait, which might possibly be the best closer look I've ever done. It's hard to top that one. I mean, it's not just, it's what you'll, and you'll see it soon. It comes down to if you could see how much work went into making sure that the the changing of the pictures matched the beat and the speed of it and stuff like that. It almost looks like it's uh, like a cartoon. It it bounces around there at the end, and it that was a really bad thing to do right there. But it, it bounces around. And then last but not least, there's the uh, the Arc Top Water Blower Bass Fishing Bait. So I've got lots of them done. But I I had this idea for this box. And I'm so happy. Jim Richards, you are the winner. Congratulations. He and I have already texted or emailed back and forth. And uh, but I wanted to show you what was exactly in here. And also I wanted you to I wanted you to if you want these more, then tell me. I do you want two a month and lesser value ones, or would you like one big one that's like a hundred, hundred and twenty dollars every month, give or take, we'll see. And then uh, you can you could possibly win it. So comment below and tell me what you think and make sure you give this a thumbs up. Really, I don't ask you for much, but honestly, if you could give this a thumbs up, that really does help because then it helps the algorithm with uh, with it, with YouTube. So do one of these, just a click. Anyway, I wanted to show you what was in this box and tell you why. Now first, Jim, I'm gonna apologize. Most of these are for, for closer looks. So there's times where a couple might be missing. Um, because one, in this case, I misrigged the first one. And then the second one is on a jig down down there that you can't see. So Jim, you're getting the Savage Year 40 Crawls. You're getting a Thunderhawk Thunderbelly. You guys haven't seen this one yet. I think you're going to like this. I just started to work on the closer look for this one. You're getting some Guggenbaits Toads. Of course, one's missing because I have to use one. You are getting some Savage Gear Razorback Worms. Haven't finished that one yet, but you'll see that is a fantastic little swim worm. Fantastic swim worm. They got ridges and all sorts of stuff. But you'll, you'll see a closer look on that one soon. You're going to get a hype, uh, what is this? Engage Twitch Shad. It's hard, hard bait. You're gonna get some Dart Spin Pros. You're gonna get the new Storm 360 GT Search Baits. You're getting all those ones. You're gonna get, uh, now they're falling over, some Thunderhawk Hybrid Divers. You're getting Berkeley Power Pop. This one might have braid attached to it. It does have braid attached to it. You're getting the uh, Spro Essential Series 165, I think that's what this one's called. I'll save that one for last. You are getting, yeah, you're getting Striking Hybrid Hunter. 
I think you're going to like that one. That one might have braid to it connected to it. It does have braid connected to it. You are getting another pack of uh, dart spins, a Thunder Hawk Lures mouse head grass jig, and I think the lure of all lures in here, which I I'm, I'm, was a little surprised I put this in here after I did it, is this one. It's the Molex 110 plus one. I just did the release on this. I know it's expensive. It's $24.99. This is a fantastic bait. I mean, this is ridiculous. So that's what's coming to you, Jim. I hope you I hope you like it. I hope I know you already appreciate it. So I, I'm happy that you're wanted. I'm really excited you want it, to be honest. So uh tell me what you guys think. Should I do these monthly? Should I do them every couple weeks? I probably could do them every couple weeks. Uh so I want to say thanks to everybody for participating. I wanted to have fun with this, to be honest, and I hope you guys had fun with it. I hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, there were a couple, I don't know if I even said this, there were a couple people, grumpy somebody, you missed it by one, one penny two or three days ago. I was kind of flipping out. When I first did this, I had a retail price, I thought the retail price was 113.38, and then I was completely wrong. There was, the dart spins were more expensive, they were $4 more, making the whole price $117.38, and that's the list, and there is the price that I had it, and that didn't include sales tax. I know people were asking about that, but I don't think I pay sales tax on these things. I could be wrong. Uh, so anyway, congratulations, Jim. Tell me what you guys think. Should we do these more often? Uh, it was just my way of saying thank you. <laughs> After the whole RoboWorm thing, for, for the love of God, I just needed to do something to get back into your good graces. And that was the whole the whole plan behind it. Um, I know what RoboWorm is now for sure. I mean, I know them better than better than I should know them. I know them better than some of the... Well, I don't even want to go down that road. Uh, that's just how it is. Anyway, I hope you guys like this. If you can do me a favor, I don't ever ask you to, to purchase anything or do anything. If you really want to support the channel really the best thing to do is just give it a, give the every every video a thumbs up that really does help me in all honesty it'll help the channel grow and as the channel grows it's only going to help y'all because honestly at 6000 i didn't you didn't you would have caught some of it there's boxes on the other side over there that are full of lures two or three lures in every pack i'm going to try to give out 20 of them at 6000 so 20 20 people win there might be some Taco Warehouse gift cards in there too. You never know. Anyway, guys, I hope you have a blessed day. Congratulations, Jim Richards. Awesome. Good job. Dude, good job. I really thought this was going to go to the end. I thought for sure this was going to be a last day thing. Nope, Jim did it. Make sure you guys have a great day. Take a kid fishing. Get your fish on. Cheers. Thanks, guys, for everything. Seriously. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe, click up here. If you want to see our last video, it should be right here. Take a kid fishing, get your fish on. Cheers.